Uh, you can tell it's uh, election time. I get these uh, stupid flyers in the mail, and uh, I was looking at one of these. Uh, I don't know why, but it looks like this guy, Fred, here, and his wife, they're about to bite my hand or something. They look mean. And I was looking around. Let's see. Ryan's. I don't understand why that's in there. I guess maybe they're, uh, maybe they're going against uh, your well-being and good health. That makes sense. Ryan's. Uh, David Curry. Nice looking man. Good family. Uh, attack ad. Uh, yeah. The funny part about this is you never see who the attack ad's from really in big print. You have to look really carefully where it says, let's see, up here. The tiny print. Paid for by Senator John Douglas Re-Election Committee. I mean, I, I understand attacking someone, you know, trying to help yourself, but it really, I don't think it pays off that much because you're not, you're not being, you're not putting publicity out there for your own name. But uh, that's fun. It, I ran across this at it. I thought it was weird. Here's a uh, B.J. Mathis, chairman. It's a weird name for a girl. She looks happy. And it, they show this picture of her family. And it's like, what the hell? Is that like two bald men and three wives and three kids? What the crap is going on? <laughs> is this some kind of big old... Uh, I mean, if she gets in the office, she's going to approve of... Uh, Orgy marriages or something? Good grief. Um, what the hell? I'd say keep it simple, BJ. I mean, you already got a stupid name. You might as well keep it simple like your name, you know. Don't go into all this crazy sex rampage with bald men and other w women and stuff. I don't understand it. See that other guy, let's see, David Curry. Curry. Smart choice. You got the red, white, and blue in there. That's genius. Got a picture of him alone, so we know he could do it alone. But then look. Family. There's a wife. There are two daughters, two boys. They all look creepily similar to their parents. But then you got this crazy sex variety show going on. And also, I mean, I'm gonna, I am gonna—I guess I'm going to nitpick in here, but if she's running for office, should she be kind of like the highest head on this crazy sex totem pole? She should be up here where Lex Luthor is, or at least above Dana White. She shouldn't be down here with the two bastard children of this crazy beast of a thousand backs um, that, that's all I had to say uh, really I thought this was stupid advertising BJ uh, you're not gonna get my vote because you're having sex with 10,000 families breaking news she's also Muslim <laughs>